Yo, this is Glocko Blocko, and we're checking out a game called Wavin. This is an online game, although you can play it solo, so you don't have to have friends to play with. It's a turn-based RPG tactical. The year 1000. Harmony has been shattered. Here you are at the bottom of the ocean. You, survivors, must now forge your own destiny. What kind of hero will you be? That's the premise. So you start off and you gotta make your character. You can choose a healer, a warrior, an archer, mage, an assassin. Each of them with their own skill trees and attacks. You can choose a male or a female. Though these days, maybe it doesn't matter so much. Call, him, call her Redhead. So we chose the warrior. Here we are on the starter map. Guy rolls up. Got a few ships with him. So he throws you a bone. I didn't expect to find anyone this far from everything. You must be sick of eating crab by now. I'm guessing you wouldn't say no to the idea of sailing off to New Horizons. Ho ho ho! You're in luck. I've just the thing for you. It's just a piece of wood, but it should hold as far as the island of Astrum, a little to the north. <laughs> Yo ho! Good luck! Alright, there's a pirate dropped off a little ship for us, and you can head into town. The first island is more of a tutorial island. You just gotta meet with this guy and he'll train you up a bit. I thought the voice acting was pretty decent in this game. A lot more than I would have expected for this type of game. Don't worry, you're not my first trainee. You'll have to hit harder to get rid of it. So you've got your movement squares, and then you can do an attack. Sometimes you can do several attacks, depending on how many points you have. Courage. He's ugly, but basically armless. First you grab your character, and then you drag them to the spot that you want them to move. Eventually you'll have more than just the one character. You have pets and summonables. You jerk. The opponent attacked you and lost health weapons. 
He seems rather annoyed, doesn't he? If you just want a standard attack, just drag and drop your character onto the other the enemy. You should equip the spells you just got. Click on the sword to open the thing. These are your spells. For now, you have nine, but you'll get more. To build a valid deck, you need to equip a minimum of nine. Spells have different elements. There are five elements. Fire, blah, 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 blah. Or, let's see, it's correct. So you get some spells, and you can add them to your hotbar. I guess we'll throw all these in here. You get quite a few to start off, which is pretty cool. I only have eight. Or, no, that's nine. Alright. Oh, that one came at the perfect. Not sure how he didn't kill him. Seemed like he did a whole bunch of damage. Playing a spell costs your action points. You have six action points per turn. First we hit him with a wave, I think. Hopefully I'm not stuck in this tutorial the whole time. Then we end our turn. He's hiding behind a shield. It'll take trickery to get him. He did some pretty heavy damage on me. So we hit him with this purple one. Okay, let me do it. Tutorials piss me off. As predicted, he canceled out the damage from your hit. And we hit him with the green rock. Well played. For a final hit, we bash him with our sword. Nope, not the final hit. He's too strong. To come out on to the next one. Fights are more fun when you've got allies. Equip the com So we got our first summonable partner or monster. Not sure what you'd call him. Animal, pet. Maybe pet is the best word. So while he's taking the big one, I'll take the little ones. Our pet wasn't summonable yet. Sometimes you gotta build up some points before you can summon the pet. Get that guy with a wave, then we could summon our pet. Throw him right there. And then the tutorial wanted us to attack. So we obliged. 
the big guy was still alive though. <laughs> well played. Our leader wasn't doing a very good job taking him out. Took out the big guy. On to the little, little guys he summoned. Well, you've got the basic step. So that was Tutorial Island, and I think we're on to the next one now. For sure, a monstrous thing came out of the rift last night. So this is your starter island. You'll see, Astrov is a great island to live on. If you want to make yourself useful, go reassure the villagers. They've been a bit unsettled ever. So you have to go around and talk to all these all right, characters well, around the map. Girl. Let's put a <laughs> exclamation over They'll here. give you a quest. And then you can start a new combat map. You can also adjust the level of each map. So if it's too easy, you can increase the difficulty. An old man. Can anyone help me? We didn't fully understand how we were supposed to interact with them. We figured it out eventually, but at the time we didn't know how to access their missions. This is the local pub. Nothing much to do in here, at least not at that time. All right. Come over here. This lady had a Come mission for me. Hmm, you don't look very strong, but I've learned to be wary of appearances. I'll get straight to the point. We're at war. Villages are being sacked. The inhabitants end up on the slave market. It is intolerable. I run rescue missions to free the unfortunate. If you feel up to it, I'll send you on the next one. But be warned, it's a one-way ticket. You'll have to make your own way back. Oh, maybe... Do this. Oh, okay, there we go. We finally figured out how to enter the battle scene. Let's battle these cats. One down, three to go. Throwing our pet out there. 
have him attack one of the cats. I move forward closer. Stupid cats. Alright, what's the most damage? So this is your basic setup for every combat scenario. Got a grid, a big square you can move through. Later in the game you find that they're able to put up blockades so you can only go certain blocks. So they can kind of box you in or block you off. Got them all dead. Won that one pretty easy. Pick a spell. Alright, what does the most damage? Thanks! I hope you'll go back to Over to the lady up north. Come over here. Ironside Island. The game's pretty Careful. simple. There are rogues. Out come the rogues. <laughs> Do I kill these guys first? Or what? Let's kill this lady first. I thought for a moment we were supposed to unlock the cages, but it doesn't appear that you need to do that. Just gotta defeat the bad guys, then you're good to go. This has been Waven, a tactical multiplayer RPG with unique voice acting, great combat, and rewarding progression. Check out the game below via the link in the description. Bomb guys are annoying. My guy died. Uh, getting our butts kicked. Let's see. Three more to go. This one was see, we can a little beat harder than the last, but. Not too bad. They had us down one third. One down. Got rid of the big guy. Now the bomb and the little guy were left. little guy up and we were good to go not bad rookie you did well keep it up there are so many victims to help in the struggle Vanta will need soldiers like you as for you'll see for guess we didn't need to help them so there were many people to help in this world we decided to try the kitten one again
one kitten down, three to go. How are they scratching me from so far away? Figured a big green rock would take care of him, but it wouldn't let me put that one, so he switched to a different one. They were tougher than they looked. Now there's more of them. One down, two more to go. Beat the head guy. Lucky for us, they weren't doing too much damage. Well, it's a pretty simple game. But I thought everything that it does, it does pretty well. Like the graphics, the grid, the spells. Level 3. The characters you meet, everything's done pretty darn well. Thanks for watching the video. If you'd like to check out more games, subscribe and check back. I play RPGs, indie games, and oddball games. See you in the next one. One down. Oh, this guy can attack too. So this level was a little bit tough. Cause you gotta keep the little green character alive. Turned out to be more durable than I w would imagine. Got my guy. Hopefully, they didn't kill the green guy. Geez, they're multiplying. With our pet down, it was just me and the little green critter.
Stay alive, green guy. How's this guy still alive? It's Okay, one more. Heading across the map, we head over to try and save the little girl. Alright, two more. Or green girl. Another tough map. This was the toughest one yet. They would try and block in with their tiles. I don't know what these pools do. But they were also three pretty powerful enemies. When the blue guys die, they leave a permanent spot. Think that you can't get through. Dang it, they already killed him. Doing some heavy damage. How's that guy not dead? Let's see if we survive this one. This one's rough. Got him down. One more to go. Oh no, he's not dead yet. Oh crap. Oh crap. Beat the big guy, we got defeated by the little squids. In structure, eh? Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? This one actually takes us a few tries. I said you did, hey? Right? Says he won't. Tried to be a bit more strategic this time. Though it didn't work in the end. Seems like maybe they don't want to cross that blue tile. One down.
so close. They had me pretty trapped. survive this guy. Nearly dead, we were trying to defeat the big guy. Didn't work out in the end though. They had me just where they wanted me. Freaking rough. This time, our strategy was to try and take him out as quick as we could and not get trapped like that. Time will tell. We also wanted to see what they were going to do if I didn't move. previous attempts. Oh, well, we're not trapped like last time. He's got 65. Both of the little guys down, we were down to the big guy. We were looking pretty good considering our health. I don't know if he got me this time or not. Can't remember. He was getting lower. Slowly but surely. Maybe we're in a better position, we'll see. Our health was steadily climbing down. So it was a close one. We got the victory in the end, though. That's the game, though. You just kinda go around and do little battles. It's surprisingly addictive. You wouldn't expect it, but found myself playing for another hour on accident, so definitely worth it if you enjoy this style of game.